guys, I'm Emma. Thank you so much for joining us if you are brand new. And if you are not brand new and you've been here before, then thank you for coming back and joining us in all of our adventures. So this week is my birthday week. And I'm super excited. Um, we thought that you, we haven't done very many like Q and A's or get to know me's or anything like that um, so far. And we've been on YouTube for nearly a year. Um, so, I mean, I think you guys could probably have got to know us through like our vlogs and things like that. But because on Monday, so you'll be seeing this after Monday. So when you're seeing this, I am now 31. So I decided to do 31 facts about me. So, I hope you find some of these interesting, I hope some of these are things you didn't know. If you do ever have any questions about me or John or YouTube or Disney or just life, then always drop them down in the comments below. We're always super excited to hear from you guys anyways. But I think we should just get into it because I'm already like three minutes in and I'm going to have to cut some of this intro. So, fact number one. You will already know this if you're good at maths. I was born in 1988, so technically an 80s baby. Um, fact number two, I have one sister and two brothers and me and my sister used to fight, oh god, like enemies until we were both older teenagers and then now we get on great so that's nice and I get on great with both my brothers as well. Fact number three, I graduated from Bath Spa University in Education Sociology. Fact number four, I love to read, I love watching booktube, um, specifically I read past my bedtime which is Nikki over there, I love her videos um, but I love to read, love a book, mostly like YA fantasy but I do dabble in other genres as well. Number five, I believe in the law of attraction. So you guys can look that up if you want to but I think it's a really positive way to look at life and I enjoy the more positive aspects of life so yeah. Um, Number six, I'm really good at learning by myself, so I'm good at picking up a book and learning from that, or watching tutorials and learning from that, so yeah, I like to learn that way. I like like a school setting too, but I also really like to learn by myself. Number seven, I have never ever smoked a cigarette. Go me. Number eight, um, so when I was ten, I had pneumonia and pleurisy and I nearly died, and if you guys want to hear more about that journey then let me know down in the comments and I can tell you the full story but um yeah it was a scary time but I'm okay now and I've got a really cool scar so that's pretty good um I hate all hot drinks um I have hot chocolate actually but I only have it warm so I don't think that counts so I don't drink tea I don't drink coffee I don't drink lattes or any of that fancy Starbucks stuff so I feel like I'm missing out, but I also really hate them. Um, number 10, I overreact for no reason, but I underreact when there is a reason to be overreacted, if that makes sense. So that was just fun. Number 11, I think everybody does, but I hate bullies. Um, adult bullies or kid bullies or just anybody that hasn't got nice things to say about somebody. If you haven't got anything nice to say, well, we all know not to say anything at all. So don't say anything. Um, number 12, I'm really curious about everything. I have 9 million questions about everything all the time. So if I do ask you 9 million questions and it's annoying, I'm really sorry, just tell me to stop. But I will probably have asked you a question at some point. Uh, number 13, Vans and Converse are my favourite shoes. They're so comfy and I just love them. Vans at the moment are my particular favourite, but last year it was Converse, so you know. Um, number 14. I would love, love, love to write a book, but I have no idea what to write about and I also don't have the attention span to sit down and write it, so, but one day I might do. Number 15. Um, oh, I really hate, um, this is a YouTube one. So you know all of like the trending videos for a while were like tea and like ah oh, tea, oh, I hate that. I hate tea videos, I think it's just drama, I hate drama channels and things like that. Like I, I kind of like to watch them for the cringe of them if that makes sense. Um, number, what number am I on? 16 maybe? I'm not religious but I am curious about religion. 
number 17. Don't like short hand texts and I don't, but I do like emojis. Like I really love an emoji, but I don't like like the see you later thing. Hate that. Nobody ever knows what you mean and it doesn't take much longer to just write out the actual text. So why don't people just do that? Um, I don't know what number I'm on anymore. So next fact is I play the trumpet. Um, I played in a band from like the age of 11 maybe until I was 18. Um, I have a purple trumpet. I should have brought it with me to show you, but I didn't. Um, I played in a jazz band called the Deck Tap and we went to France once and did some playing there. Um, yeah, it was, it was a cool time. Um, I still practice sometimes. I really should practice more. Um, my next fact, my favorite musical is Les Miserables. Um, I'm really getting into, um, I haven't seen Hamilton, but I'm really getting into the songs from Hamilton. So I think once I've seen that, maybe that will be my favorite. Um, but at the moment it's Les Miserables. Uh, next fact is I love birthdays. I obviously love my own birthday, but I really enjoy other people's birthdays as well. I like that it's a day just to celebrate them. So I think that's a really cool and it's nice to celebrate it. So. Um, next fact is I'm from Manchester. In case you didn't guess from my accent, but I am from Manchester. Um, I travelled down to Wiltshire where we live now when I was 18 with my parents. So imagine what my life would be like if I stayed in Manchester, it would be different. Uh, next fact, I have a fear of bridges and tunnels and also the thought of fa space, not face, <laughs> the thought of space really freaks me out. Like actually makes like butterflies in my stomach. So I think I might have a little fear of space as well. But I also am really curious about space, so that's not very helpful, because whenever I think about it, like I, I get the butterflies, so I don't know. Um, next fact is I've had three dogs in my life. Um, I've had two guinea, uh, four guinea pigs, a cockatiel, we've had a mouse called Mickey, obviously, uh, nine zillion hamsters, so yeah. Uh, sorry if we've moved, my camera battery died. You all know the problems there. Um, so I don't know where I was up to. So my next fact is that I have a teddy bear from when I was three. My nana bought it from a car boot sale. Um, so he was second hand when I got him and I instantly fell in love with him. I named him Tony with a Y after one of my dad's friends at the time um, and my I don't know if my dad didn't like his friend that much but they all tried to persuade me not to name my bear Tony and I did it anyway because I'm a rebel. Uh, next fact is I love to travel but I don't like traveling which is not the easiest of things like I don't like to fly I don't really like to sit in a car for too long don't really like trains boats are fine actually I like boats but yeah but I like the holiday or the trip when you get there so needs must you know um oh next fact is a uh, I don't know it's a bit of an embarrassing one so you know like when everybody has the uh, kind of I don't know, is it called a guilty pleasure? The guilty pleasure like music that they listen to. Well, mine is the band Blue. They're not together anymore, I don't think. Um, but I, I know every single word from their albums, all of them, like way better than I know any music now. I know all of the words. And I used to be completely in love with Lee Ryan. Don't tell him, that'd be awkward. Um, next fact. I watch Morgan Freeman like it is life. Anything Morgan Freeman's in, well, I say anything, there's probably things I haven't watched, but if I'm uh, like um and iron about whether to watch something and Morgan Freeman's in it, I will watch him. I will watch it. Like, I've seen Las Vegas because he was in it, even though that looked rubbish. It was a bit rubbish. But Morgan Freeman was in it. His voice is just so relaxing to me. I just really love him. Next act is I can only really watch one TV series at the time. So at the moment I'm watching Handmaid's Tale and I'm committed to Handmaid's Tale and I don't have enough time in my life um, with like YouTube and work and Louie and you know, just life to commit to another series. So once um, the season is over for the Handmaid's Tale, I will be able to start something else. But until then, I am fully committed to the Handmaid's Tale. I don't know if anybody else does that. like when you watch more than, do other people watch more than one TV series at once? Is it just me that just watches one? I don't know. I, I don't know. But let me know what I should be watching next after The Handmaid's Tale because I have no idea. Okay, next. 
fact. Um, I like the beach. I like to go to the beach, but I hate seaweed and I don't really like sand that much, so I don't really know what I like about the beach. Uh, next fact. I have one tattoo. It is this one. Uh, oh, you can't see it. I can't twist my arm so you can see it. There. It's a bow anyway. Um, and I went into the shop and inquired and he was like, oh, I've got space now. So I sat down and got it done and happy with my decision. I know tattoos should mean something to people, but it's a fun memory, so. Um, next fact, I don't really like flowers. Just don't like them. And final fact, I think I've gone over 31, so I might have to chop a fact out somewhere um, to keep it to 31. But I, when I was younger, I really wanted to play in the Queen's Band, and then I don't know if it's true or if somebody told me, um, but I then found out, whether it's true or not, I'm not sure, that it was only men that were able to play in the Queen's Band, so then I had to change my mind about that. Not that that was a real option for me anyway, but you never know. But that crushed my dreams, so I don't play in the Queen's Band anymore. <laughs> but I hope that you learned something by watching this video. If you do have any questions that I haven't mentioned, then please comment down below. But then next year we will be doing 32 facts about me, and John will be doing his facts about him in his video in September. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you learned a, bit, a little bit about me. Um, I know some of them were silly facts, but that's fun, right? And I will see you probably tomorrow in my next video because it's Emma week. So thanks for watching. Bye.